I'm full of anticipation, but at the same time worried about how I'm going to feel tonight. <laughs> Probably pain. A little bit of pain, yeah. We have no idea. <laughs> Rain. Rady over there. We don't know if we're going to be spending the night here again or if we go. Um, hard day. Hard day. <laughs> a few, few massages. You know, Hoping to get airlifted time out. Time out. It's going to be bad. To crawl, maybe to walk a little bit. Slow start, then the heat hits in. And oh, yeah. then you're going to really, really wean out the competitors, mate. We'll see how we go. <laughs> Charging along and pushing each other. A few falls, a couple of like, slides on the butt. Pretty easy. Pretty fun. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty fun to do it as a team though. We have hell coming. Um, we have an incline like this that we are really looking forward to. Uh, this is Victor. This is Victor the vacationer. Fuck yeah, yeah. you! <laughs> so we're about to go. So ask us at the end how we're feeling. <laughs> Except I have cramps in both legs. <laughs> Looking forward to the bar, hopefully. <laughs> Even the diggers had beer. Day two of Race to Survive, I think, was getting our feet nice and wet. Cool them down to be able to get up the rest of the hills that we had to go up. But not as many. I was on two feet, not two feet, two hands this time. <laughs> The last two days have been character building. The first day was challenging and the second day was as challenging, if not a bit more challenging, now that my legs are, you know, like jelly. We did a lot of team building activities, so holding on to ropes and trying to get over to the other side and staying on one platform as a team. Oh, and dancing, oh, lots of dancing. Loving the dancing. Loving the dancing is the best part. feeling of the event is fantastic. The whole spirit is really good, yeah. Like, yeah. you know, mateship, yeah. endurance. Um, Courage. Courage. Teamwork. Teamwork, yeah. yeah. I'd yeah. do it a hundred times yeah. over. Just the support that everyone has for each other. You know, no one really knows each other that well, but, you know, you have people coming up and just offering to give you a hand with carrying your things or motivating you to keep going and just the support from everyone was really good. They were really good in motivating me and getting me through the tough times. I've kept in my tears until I crossed the finish line, but apart from that, I stayed strong. And it really was a team, a team yeah. environment. We had to do challenges that weren't just physical, but they were mental as well. And it really took everyone to be on board and contribute. so many moments where I think we all thought the body didn't have any more left and you just all of a sudden this energy would just hit you when you'd see the team right behind you on your tail and and we just kept pushing and I just can't believe how much we gave it was an amazing effort. Everyone pulled together we got each other across the line and when people needed uh, shoulder to lean on we were there for each other the whole way from start to finish it was a great journey. I think we 
just try and get behind what a court does. Um, and I think for me as a young person, when you see people your age on the street with, with not much to look up to and, and that sort of thing when, you know, an average person our age has everything to look forward to, it's, um, it's something you jump behind and go, that's not fair or that's not right and, and we can do something about that. You know, we work in hotels so we, you know, have a lot of people who, our hotel's like a second home and so we know the importance of, you know, having that shelter and making that difference. Racism means a lot, a lot to us because we are so blessed with where we are and what we do, and it's great to come together as such a big group and have such a massive impact with all the funds we raise and actually proving that we are tough and we can actually do these things. And because of the size that a core has, I think when when everyone gets behind it, you know, half a million dollars is a lot of money and it does a lot of good things.